All right, I got another brand new one here for you tonight. Looking pretty cool, man. The game page kind of caught my eye, so I was like, I gotta check that out. But uh, let me read you what we got here. It sounds pretty cool. You control the found footage. An FBI intern leaked special investigation tapes before suddenly disappearing. The first tape of the series contains found footage from O'Brien State Park, revealing the true events that were covered up in the 1980s. This is only the first tape, or first of many tapes leaked by FBI intern Valerie Bardot. There seems to be a bigger picture slowly being revealed by whoever tampered with the tapes post leak. So uh, somebody's got tapes and they're putting them out, you know, for us to check out and, you know, figure out what the hell is going on here. Not a lot of info about it, but uh, I kind of like, you know, not knowing too much about it. Leaving without a trace, she suddenly went missing at the end of her internship in Lancaster, California. Foul play is suspected. She's looking a little evil, man. I don't really trust her. As long as Valerie is missing, these tapes will continue to be leaked. We gave you a chance, and this will be your last. The information conveyed through this debrief training tape pertains to a prior investigation. It is imperative that agents refrain from viewing this material unless they possess the appropriate clearance and are under the direct supervision of an instructor. Any failure to comply with this directive will result in prosecution to the fullest... Oh shit, cut me off man, I was trying to read it to you. Debrief, 1988. Alright, alright, good to know, thank you. Previously inhabited by both Dakota and o Ojibwe, I don't know how to say that, Ojibwe tribes it is now home to year-round camper and hikers. The park along with other state parks up north has experienced an increase in animal-like attacks. Oh shit. The cause was unknown until found- oh shit, damn it, not enough time to read these fucking things. On August 25th, 1988, Bradley Kaufman, a 59-year-old male, visited O'Brien State Park unaccompanied. The subject's behavior during his visit was unusual as he intermittently started recording at various times medical records revealed god damn it subsequently on august 26 the subject was reported as missing his body was discovered on august 30 and the recovered footage from his recording device will now be presented in chronological order accompanied by annotations sorry trying to get through that real quick man they cut me off i can't read what's going on here whoa whoa what kind of camera are we using man uh, it's 1988, so uh, a potato. Subject initiated recording. The reason for their sudden re oh fucking thing. Hard to read that. I'm not picking anything up. What am I cooking? Subject would occasionally zoom on certain objects. All right, I was gonna do that. What are we cooking, man? No eggs in there. What do you got around here? You don't. You don't have much food. You better go hunt. Am I alone? I was like, what the hell's moving? What do I got in there? Not very comfy looking. Ooh, I'll take that. I need that weapon. Was it like a hoverboard? My weapon. Are we rolling out? Alright, get to it. Subject turned right and went to the bathroom to shower. Alright, we're going right. What do you got over there, though? I kind of want to know what's over there. Alright, find my shower tree. Go find a waterfall, you know? A little creepy out here. Hope I uh, don't get attacked by an animal. It better be like a little animal. Like a raccoon or something, you know, I could fight off. Don't need a bear coming after me. What the fuck is that? Oh, a chop tree. I was like, I don't even know what I'm looking at. Oh, hello, neighbor. Oh, no entry, huh? I'm gonna greet the neighbor. What the? Who did that? 
Were you a neighbor or was that mine? Alright, we're not alone out here. Although I feel alone. Be pretty cool to go for like a late night walk, although uh, I don't really trust wild animals, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, are you the shower? I don't know, man. You might be. <laughs> I can't read that. <laughs> whoa, whoa. No lag now. Alright, go right in. Don't shower in the urinal. Do I even want to look? You better be flushed, man. We don't need a poop killer out here. What the hell is fucking smoking? Was that toilet burning up? That took a fiery dump. Oh, what the fuck? Wait, should I go right in? Knock, knock. Got room for two? They're like, no, you can't watch uh, the shower. <laughs> Subject stops filming, then takes a shower. It's estimated 10 minutes elapsed before the sub- Oh, fuck. I need time to read, man. Even when I, you know, read it too quick. It ain't quick enough. Oh, I was like, what the hell's that? Is Candyman gonna come? He's all, I heard you're looking for Candyman, bitch. Boom. <laughs> Knock. Oh, I thought I was running. Wait, okay, did I shower and my head back? I kind of want to keep going. I don't know if I need to head back to camp. Oh, yep. Can't go that way. Head on back. Alright, good shower. It was kind of creepy. Whoa, what the fuck are you, man? What the fuck was that? Is that a shadow? You alive, you fucking tree? And that shit moving is uh, tripping me out. You get away from me, damn it. Hard to tell what I'm looking at. Fucking 1980s camera. Hmm, neighbors, you alright? You guys make it through my shower? I wasn't gone that long. You better not die. You better, you know, be alive and fight with me. Uh, anyone around? Bunch of moving plants, man. Creeping me out. It's like waving to me, They're like, goodbye. We know what's gonna happen to you. Hmm. Oh wait, did I... Oh fuck, where was my camp? Okay, you're my camp. Wait, who are you? Hmm. Why is the chair in the fire? Okay, I was like, what the hell? Pause two. Upon return to the campsite, an unknown figure stands near the subject's tent. Neither campground records nor the witnesses recall seeing a white male this profile. Why this person was here or who they are still remains unknown but is not being actively pursued. Largest jump of times happens at this point with an estimate of one to two hours time elapsed. The recording resumes with the subject the recording resumes with the subject two miles in the hardwood hills loop. Why the subject started oh fuck. Hard to read that man. I'm trying, you might just you know have to pause it and read. Wait, where are we going? Down? Be a fun bike trail. If you got brakes on your bike. Be fucking jamming. You know, don't hit a tree though. Be your last bike ride. Kind of a creepy game. I feel like I don't really need to be worried, you know, but uh I'm sure the ending will prove me wrong. What are you, like a firefly? What is that noise? What am I hearing? Is that in the game or is that on the road outside? <laughs> I think I'm hearing a car on the highway. I was like, who's driving out here? The fuck are you? Oh, you trees? I thought I was like a scarecrow.
do live trees. There's gonna be like Evil Dead where the woods come after me. Like, do bad things to me. Please don't. Wait, are those tire tracks? I better not get run over. Someone has been driving through here. Are we going to find Bigfoot? I feel like every game I'm playing tonight, I'm talking about Bigfoot. <laughs> I don't know why. He's on my damn mind, though. I was like, what, wait, what is that all shiny? Am I tripping? What is that, our toilet? Whoa. Give me the chills, little buddy. Big buddy. New buddy. Come hang out. Come give me a ride, man. Fucking dude's in no hurry at all. You know, tiptoeing through the night. Probably better not to go, you know, too quickly. Keep your eyes on everything around you. What are you, a bridge? Alright, cool. Don't mind if I do. Uh oh. That was no deer. I knew we should have brought that hatchet, man. Who the fuck would go out in the woods without a hatchet? If you got one with you, you know? It's like, duh, bring it. You know, you don't have a belt with your hatchet on it. You'd be that prepared. You don't go out into the woods without, you know, any kind of weapon at least, you know? <laughs> or like friends. Bring a damn crew with you. Oh shit, wait. You're not the one I just, uh, killed by an entity. Hmm, you weren't alive a minute ago, were you? Uh oh. Don't cut out when there's noise, man. Subject encountered a deceased deer attacked by entity. The film abruptly ends after subject detects entity in vicinity. Subject is, exhibits distress and flees off trail. Entity pursues subject and can be heard in proximity. Subject resumes filming approximately four minutes after pause. Oh shit. Am I running? Displaying emotions of fear. Uh, which fucking way am I going, man? Oh, we're not on a path anymore. Oh shit. I can't even read that. We're fucking running. Okay, now it's getting a little freaky. And we're out in the fucking middle. We're off course, man. We're we're just in the grass right now. We might as well just like duck and hide. That tree is floating. Uh, pardon me. Who's there? Blair Witch, is that you? Bigfoot? Who's here? Oh, shit. Might be fucking Pepsi, man. Uh, we're going deep, man. We're in trouble. You get off the path, you know that much. You're as good as dead. You didn't bring anything with you. Oh, shit. Run, fuckhead. Oh, fuck. We're in like an invisible wall. I'm cornered. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, made me look at him. <laughs> what the hell are you? Subject struggles against entity, but gets away. The camera is severely damaged. Oh, my God. 
Bradley Kaufman's death would occur over the next five minutes. The remaining footage has been cut short for viewer discretion. Additional entities can be heard and would later fight over the remains. The footage ends. Oh, shit. They even say the camera ran out. Subjects' remains were found scattered. Most flesh was consumed. Little personal items remained intact. The public was told it was an abnormal bear attack. Got fucking brutalized, man. I told you bring the hatchet. You don't fucking listen, though. Subject's film was the first footage captured. Ultimately, subject's footage provide the Bureau proof to extend funding and special operation to contain entities. This case marks the first of many successful entity resolution something. Couldn't read it, man. Too quick. Wendigo. Oh, yeah, you're a little creepy. Wendigos are creatures or originated from Native American tribes of the Great Lakes, Great Lakes region. The malevolent supernatural beings bring terror to forest dwellers and are linked to numerous missing person cases. God damn it. Not enough time to read. You have to pause it. According to recent intelligence, there has been a notable resurgence of the Wendigo and their geographical distribution has now expanded southward toward Minneapolis. In response to this emerging threat, the Bureau has established a joint task force in collaboration with the Canadian CSIS to take immediate and decisive action. Fuck, man, it's a lot to read. It's imperative to maintain strict operational security and keep the general public uninformed of these operations to prevent any unnecessary panic or interference. Sorry, my voice is a little dry tonight, man. A lot of reading. It's my third game of the night, too, so I'm a, I'm a little talked out here. <laughs> That's pretty cool, man. Pretty creepy. Oh, the story doesn't end here. That was like episode one. So it's like, you know, part one here. Gonna be uh, more coming. I'll definitely check out some more of that because uh, that was pretty cool.